So you love planning and are already preparing for New Year's over six months in advance? Well, then you probably thought of creating some firework animations to spam in every WhatsApp, Instagram, and Discord group you're in. So with Blender open, you want to obliterate the default cube, add an icosphere with as many subdivisions as your potato of a computer can handle, and with a selected atom particle system. Add another object and set it as the render object. Wow, that's a depressing firework. Tweak the normal and random velocities and set the start and end frame to 1. If you want to feel like God, maybe decrease gravity a bit. Play with the render scale and its corresponding randomness letter until you're happy with the results. Now is a good time to tweak the lifetime. Add a little particle system slot and select the particle system you just made. Click on the little 2 to create an unlinked copy or else you will override the hard work you spent 30 seconds on to create. Duplicate the icosphere and select it in the new particle system. Now tweak it until you get something that starts later and has bigger particles that move faster. Repeat the process one last time making them start even later and make them slower than the original ones. Let's add the materials, but before you continue you should set the background to black. Select the first icosphere and add a new material. Replace the principal BSDF with an emission shader and set the first icosphere to blue, second to pink, the last one to orange. Now increase the strength to get more blue. You can go fancy and add a black body node to get realistic color for the last them, but what I like to do is film a real explosion in my room instilling a color from that with an eyedropper tool. After spending a couple of days tweaking all the settings, you should make the simulations. Now we just need to add a camera, enable bloom and motion blur, and tweak those for another couple of days. You'll be happy to hear that in Blender 2.9 it is now even possible to render object motion blur in Eevee. Hit render. If you want to skip the hassle of tweaking your own simulation, you can get the blend file for free on Gumload. Link in the description. See ya!